What is going on you guys? Holy Pokemon back again. It is finally the moment you have all been waiting for. It's back. It's tin time you guys. We have five Kanto power tins to open up in today's video. Let's get right into it. We're going to open up this Vulpix and Pikachu tin. It's very nice, very nice artwork on the front of these. I, uh, all of these artworks are really sick. I'm really excited for you guys to see all of them. Uh, we got some Mewtwo, Mew Charizard in here. But I'm not sure what packs come inside of these. I'm pretty sure they don't come with any evolutions, but that would make the most sense to me for it being a Kanto Power tin. We have a Genesect coin on the front there. I'm not sure even what color that is. Blue? We have a Crimson Invasion and a Steam Siege, so not too bad. Um, I could do without the Steam Siege, but you get a nice uh, cigarette tin, or maybe for some gum. I love those tins. And uh, as always, you get this art cart. I will assemble them all at the end and show you guys what they look like. But let's jump into some Steam Siege right away. Code card for you. We have three to the front for X and Y. We have a Nidorino on the front with a Steelix Spirit Link, Rapidash, Mantine, Mareep, Chimchar, Bergmite, Clauncher, Reverse Hollow Ponyta. I'm really digging that. And a Amoongus. There's a Fungus Amoongus. Crimson Invasion, Sun and Moon. Let's see what we got. Four to the front. Let's go. We got a Fighting Energy with Miltank, a Snoozin, Kakuna, a Selgor, Carablast, Ugly, Swablu, Pumpkaboo. A lot of rhyming in this pack. We have a Execute, Weedle, a Reverse Hollow Gengar, that is a rare, and we have a Alolan Marowak Holographic on the end. Next tin, we have a Mewtwo tin art there, reaching for the sky, maybe doing, charging up for a Spirit Bomb. Do I have any Dragon Ball Z fans in here? I think that card game's actually making somewhat of a comeback. Maybe, who knows? We have a different coin. We, it looks like we have Solgaleo. Uh, it might be upside down. There he is right there. Solgaleo. That's nice, actually, because I've had these tins before where they just include one. And so you get a set of five <laughs> of, uh, you know, rather it's Garchomp or whatever have you, Manaphy, in the tin. And they just end up going straight into the garbage. Sun and Moon, Crimson Invasion, Crimson Invasion, and uh, Steam Siege up again. Let's do Crimson Invasion first this time. We got a code card there. Four to the front. Let's see. Fairy Energy starting us off. We have a Star Ravia, Lucimine, a Selgor, Weedle, Skiddo, Starly, Corfish, Pumpkaboo, Oranguru, Guru Reverse. That is a rare. And we have Registeel on the end. I was always a fan of this card. It just seems uh, like ominous in some sort of ways because I think these like scientists turned out to be bad in the Sun and Moon games. And um, I don't know, it just looks like uh, they're manipulating or controlling even uh, Registeel. We have a Steam Siege pack. Code card again with three to the front. Not a big fan of these tins because it goes back and forth between uh, uh, Steam Siege or X and Y and Sun and Moon. So I gotta keep remembering which one I'm on. We got Tangrowth, Special Charge, Litleo. So derpy looking, eh? We got Meryl, Ponyta, Dino, Litwick. We have a break. We have another Yveltal break. I just got this card recently uh, in another video. Uh, but, you know, it's worth a nice chunk of change. I do remember that. And on the end, we have that Talonflame card again. I think I also got that in the same video, which is super weird. Um, there we go. You can join up there. 
And for our next tin, we have Mew with Psyduck about to lose control down there. Very nice pack arts. I'm not sure if they're supposed to be on an asteroid or if they're on top of a mountain or something. Let's see if we can get a different coin in this one. Uh, we do actually, we have a Palkia coin. Wow, that is glittery. Wow. Focus. There we go. There is Palkia. Very nice coin. I actually really like that. I've never seen that before. Crimson Invasion and Steam Siege, like always. Let's go Crimson Invasion again on the front. Crimson Invasion, another set that has jumped in price, going for about $300, $340 for a booster box, which is absolutely crazy. Prices for Pokemon cards these days are out of control. Drop a like down below if you agree. We have Carablast, Jang Mo'o, we have a Reverse Hollow Counter Energy, and a Claymation Starmie. Always like to see those. Very creative stuff that they're doing. Uh, Steam Siege up next. Another Yveltal pack. That pack just fell apart in my palms. We have a code card for you with three to the front. Let's go. We got Ninja Boy, Rapidash, Persian, Fungus, Nidoran. We have Oshawott, Ponyard, Tangela, Reverse Hollow, Ampharos. I believe that is a rare down below. And we have a Magurna EX. Wow, that is crazy, you guys. Uh, a slight bend to uh, the card here. Not a big fan of that, but we do have an EX card. Very nice. Magurna, the robot bunny Pokemon. Next tin up, we have Dragonite just popping a squat on the tip of the mountain. I'm really excited to show you guys the next card and to actually put all this art together and give you guys a little bit of an art show. And we do have another coin, but it's one we've seen before. It is just Manaphy. I was hoping that like the packs would change up like the coins were and maybe we could get something different because... I don't know, uh, maybe maybe a lot of you out there are uh, big fans of Steam Siege and Crimson Invasion, but I'm just not. We got a uh, Psychic Energy, Zwelius, Pillow Swine, Peking Red Card, Corfish, Dino, Alolan Geodude, Remoraid, Aeron, a Reverse Hollow, Grumpig, and we have a Gladion Full Art. What was I saying just now about Crimson Invasion? Uh, because I take it back. What a beautiful card this is. Wow, I have actually never seen that. This is uh, an incredible artwork here, and the texture on this card is just out of control, you guys. Very nice pull, I'm very excited for that. Next up, we have Steam Siege coming at you. Another Yveltal pack. I feel like we've seen those a lot in this video today. We have a code card for you and your mom. Give your mom that code card, man. She works so hard for you, dude. We have three to the front with Anorith, Bug Eyed Boy. We have Nidorino, Steelix Spirit Link. We have Drifloon, Meryl, Shellos, Mantine, Clink. What is that card? You just get rid of it, you guys. We have another break, and it's actually Xerneas. So we actually completed the legendary set for uh, X and Y. Get a little focus action going there. And for our last card, we have a Toxic Croak. I'm actually a really big fan of that. Really big fan of that artwork there. And for our last but not least, we have Charizard, of course. You guys, just take in this artwork for a second. It just looks super cool. I wasn't actually, when I bought this, I didn't know that Charizard had a tin in this uh, in this set here, in this tin set. But, ooh boy, when I opened this up and I saw this boy, ooh, amazing. 
Let's see the coin we have. It is a Xerneas coin. I can't remember if we had one of those yet, but I don't think we did. So we got like five different coins from uh, these tins here. Let's go. Do we have another Yveltal pack? We do not. We have Xerneas. Uh, I think you got to look out for though, if you guys are planning on buying some of this, like just take a look at how crinkled some of these packs are. They're all, the cards are like pushed way to the top. Uh, I'm assuming that is from the uh, coin jumbling around in there for over the years. Uh, so just be careful if you buy one of these and uh, you're just looking for value because these tend to be a little bit cheaper and you're looking for some cheap Pokemon cards out there. Just know that there is a high chance that your cards may come in damaged if you're planning on getting them graded. But if you're just looking to collect, then these things are absolutely perfect for you. We have Nuzleaf, Braviary, Lampent, Chimchar, we have Meowth, Hophip, Litwick, Mareep, Reverse Hollow Lampent, and a Cobalion non-holographic on the end. For our last pack of the day, we're gonna be doing Crimson Invasion. Code card for you one last time. We have four to the front. Let's see what we can get. We have a Leaf Energy on the front, a Lowland Graveler, a Molga, Laron, Mankey, Cubone, Execute, Magikarp, Mincino, we have a Reverse Hollow Type Null, and for our last card of the day, we have a Holographic, we have Xerneas, but just take a look at that Holographic real quick, you guys. They gotta bring some of this back. The, the new stuff that they're doing is just very, very, uh, very plain. I would say it's usually just a vertical holographic line, maybe horizontal, or maybe sometimes they mix it up and do a, uh, a shattered glass pattern. You guys go, that is what all of those art cards look like when they are put together. It's actually pretty cool in my opinion, one of my favorite ones, but I would say my favorite one would be the Galar Power Tins. If you guys want to go check out that video, I did a video on it. Uh, a couple months back if you guys want to go check that out link will be in the top right corner of your screen right now but those are our polls for today you guys thank you so much for watching my name is holy pokemon and i will see you in the next episode peace